Hey y'all, crazy stuff going on in the hobby. Panini, Fanatics, NFL, NFLPA, they're all suing each other, dropping contracts. Are we going to see any cards this year? Any football at all? Well, we hope Tops will step in and throw us some chrome football, but for now we'll open some baseball. How about that? So, apparently yesterday, the NFL Players Association decided that Fanatic, or not Fanatic, Spanini, hasn't met their uh, contract obligations in some way or another. They haven't released details, so we don't know exactly how, except to say that they have immediately dropped the contract with Panini and Fanatics has control of the NFLPA contract. Now don't forget, there's also an NFL contract that has to do with the logos, which has not been dropped yet. It'll be interesting if that happens, then uh, Tops will be able to put logos on their 2023 and have the full, full thing going on. But... Yeah, crazy developments. They're just suing each other back and forth. Uh, Fanatics is basically destroying Panini in every way they can. Kind of brutal. <laughs> so it's going to be interesting this year to see how that comes out. I hope we have some good football cards. Now, apparently everything Panini has printed already is still going to come out, which means we're going to get Mosaic. We've already got Score. So we'll get Score, we'll get Mosaic. As for any more, I don't know. Brian Bello, Dermis Garcia, Brett Batty, and oh, Max Freed, Silver Hollow. Nice. He is back, and he is on fire, and the Braves are on fire. Maybe the best team in the history of baseball, apparently. Let's see if they can uh, win the World Series, and maybe that will actually be the case. <laughs> uh, Cedric Mullins. Oswald Peraza. I think he's going to end up being good. Didn't really show us a lot this year, but give him a year Austin Hayes Freddie Freeman in Technicolor that's kind of cool and we have a sepia Juan Soto not bad I like Juan get as much uh those sepias are nice cards. If you get the right player, they sell for a pretty good bit. Of course, I got the Ronald Acuna, my first pack of Topps Chrome I opened this year. Of course, he's going to be MVP, and that'll be a good buyback card. I forget what the... Uh, it's not numbered, so it won't be that great, but uh, Alex Kell, Silver Hollow. I don't know much about him. He's a rookie, though. You never know. One to hold on to. Zach Gallon. We got a pink in this pack. Carlos Correa. Ian Hop. Hey, we got George Springer, who I seem to have every card they have made of George Springer. <laughs> and... We got, what, Kyle Schwarber. I think I saw that. Yep. That's kind of cool. Kind of a color match. Pink for the Phillies. Yeah, there's a lot of people talking about the knees, of course. So I had to put in my two cent worth. There's Andrew McCutcheon. My old buddy Grip and Rip. Been wanting his any inserts and stuff i guess he's got plenty of base so i'll hold on to that one for my possible set we got a prism refractor 
X Fractor, whatever they call them. Garrett Cole. Might already have that one, actually. But a lot of people talking about it. Some of them know what they're talking about. Some of them seem to forget important things like the NFL contract is still in existence. The NFLPA doesn't rule everything. Uh, some people think Tops is for sure coming, but nothing is for sure right now. Maybe they're, I'm sure they've, uh, they're, they've got stuff in the pipeline. They've got it ready to go. They just have to find out what's going on. Meantime, it almost seems like Panini is just going to go rogue and just keep putting their stuff out. And force them to come after them. If that's what they're going to do. It'll be interesting. There's Cody Clemens. I didn't know he had a rookie card in here. I got a few of his uh, Bowmans. Is that uh, Roger's son? He was a great pitcher. Let's see, we got one of these uh, really colorful ones. Insert future stars. Yeah. Seau Suzuki. Not bad. And another sepia, the final one. The final pack. Box goes so fast. Albert Pujols. Farewell card. Not bad. I can live with that. Not the best box, but hey, it's chrome. There's good stuff. I would like to have seen a uh, an autograph. I haven't seen one of those yet. Well, guys, it's going to be an interesting fall seeing what kind of football cards we get. But uh, check back tomorrow. And I'll have at least one pack of football cars to open. See you then.